Welcome to the MyFineWineLife.com tutorial on understanding the difference between lead crystal and other types of glassware. To help us quantify the difference, we're going to explore the refractive index of glass. First, why lead? Well, its refractive index is small, which means that light passing through the glass is less distorted, and thus the color of the wine you see is closer to its true color. Light waves are bent as they pass through any transparent material. The worse the refractive index of the glass, the more the light bends, and the more the color of the wine is distorted. So what if we take a wine glass, pass a laser through it, and measure how much the light bends on a calibrated target using a selection of stemware? In the My Fine Wine Life test lab, we created our custom laser test jig, allowing us to fire a beam of pure light at our calibrated target. We measured our three test glasses, Grandma's Finest Crystal Glass, a wine glass purchased from Target, and a Ravenscroft lead-free glass. As predicted, the light passes through the lead crystal without any distortion. The Target glass demonstrates a high refractive index. The Ravenscroft exhibits a small amount of light distortion. As lead is poisonous, the My Fine Wine Life team will continue to use our Ravenscroft glasses. For you purists out there, the lead does take a while to seep, so drink your wine quickly and don't store it in lead crystal. We experiment for fun, and while our sample was far too small to gather any real statistical data, we hope you feel a little more informed.